I want Oscar Isaac to breastfeed me. Huh? What do you mean by that? Um, you lactate like that? I, I don't lactate, like mm. but uh, I wish I could. Yeah, we could try it. But I don't know about that. We could try it, Antonio. <laughs> Just answer with your instinct. Don't think about it. Okay. Very important. Who is cuter? BB-8 or Baby Yoda? BB-8. Baby Yoda. The fuck? Baby Yoda. BB-8. Baby Yoda. BB-8. I slowly started to be seducted by him like he started to seduce me. I don't know the Baby Yoda thing. Really? He's yeah. so cute. Have you watched The Mandalorian? Kill it. Oh, wow. kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Stamp it, smush it, smush it. I am very uncomfortable. I die a lot. I think that's why they ask that. It's because I die. Oh, a lot. you you famously die. I get killed off a lot. Yeah, yeah but you I just get... do it so well. If you know how I feel, why would you say that? My head squished, thrown off towers. He's made a career by dying spectacularly. If you watch Law and Order, all three of them, I always die on Law and Order. You just got that kind of face. Doesn't even hurt. At this point, I'm numb. There's no feelings. Yeah, you, you want to kill it. You just want to kill it. This is the way. This kitchen's a bloody disaster. This is not. This is not cooking. I don't feel so good. Uh, oh my god. Uh, you call this? You call this rat tattoo, eh? I'm definitely. Is, is this from a cooking show or something? Yeah, yeah but you know, the guy. I, but I don't know. You know, he's like freaked out all the time. No, I don't, I don't know, and he does. I just right. know he that is. it is a cooking show. Gordon Ramsay. Okay, see, I would have never gotten it. 10,000 years, I wouldn't have gotten it. So, do we just hang out in here now until the show comes out? Relax, all right? They're serious about the no spoilers thing. Turns out. Yes, I did that. All right. I liked when we were all inside the tomb and like, or not, you know, inside uh, the, the Pyramid of Giza and it's, it's, to it's towards the end, you'll see. It's like we were shooting the, the big finale. It was at this moment that he knew. I guess I just revealed that it happens at the Pyramid of Giza. No, I'm panicking. Yeah, Don't panic. No, I am because I'm going to lose my job. But, but uh, uh, you know, it's kind of, come on, you can kind of feel that it's going towards there. Ah! I, I think we do have a lot to say about our show. Like, for instance, the fact that it's... That Steve, that I am that's shook at the Mr. Knight. Any of that. Yeah, but you can say that there's no. at the end. Hello, this is literally why we're never gonna get out of here. I don't know what to tell you. Kevin Feige got in contact and uh, told me about Moon Knight, and I said, Who? And he said, uh, Moon Knight, the comic book character. I will beat you the fuck up. Who? <laughs> Look alike. Oof. I get Jeremy Renner. I get Nathan Fillion. What handsome people. Quentin Tarantino once. Uh, <laughs> uh, baby chicken. A baby chicken. <laughs> That's right. I got a baby. When, how'd you know about the baby chicken? I just guessed. <laughs> I'm just looking at your face right now. So much. I want Oscar Isaac to blank me in the blank. It's like a Mad Libs. I want Oscar Isaac to hold me does that sound like something you want? Yes. Well, let me tell you, you'll never get it. In the study. Study. We were talking about this Marvel thing and what do you think? And, and then uh, we decided to meet up a couple days later. Mm -hmm. uh, and in that time, right. he had gotten the script. And then we sat down together and, and drank a bunch of tequila. And I got him to say <laughs> yes. And I went home and threw up. And the rest is history. <laughs> yes, I did that. Uh, Oscar, man, listen, you're you're a brave soul for uh, for one sequence there uh, in front of a lot of people, let, letting a lot of people see a lot of things. I got to hear when you. How do you prep for a day where you're going to be sitting at the head of the table with uh, with not a lot to cover yourself? An army of fluffers. Wait a minute. An army of fluffers. Disgusting! He does it himself. <laughs> it's beautiful. I just, I just bear it all, bear it all. Uh, I had a cock sock, so uh, I, I was protected, uh, and everyone else was as Brenda well. Was going, you had a what? 
with oh, sock. We've all been there. We've all, right? Yeah. yeah. Really? Well, how often do you use them? Okay, let's move on. Explain the bromance with Pedro Pascal. He's obsessed with me. And uh, I try to get away from him and he finds me. He finds, even when I change my number, he, I can't, I can't get rid of him. So it's like a, it's like a disease. What the fuck is it gonna take to get rid of this bitch? You can't get rid of me, bitch. This is from Maria. Sexy ways to spice up the bedroom, wear an Oscar Isaac mask. It's what I tell my wife to do all the time. Wow, that's pretty darn decent. What the fuck is this? Huh? Okay. Hmm. But, uh, you know, it's kind of, come on, you can kind of feel that it's going towards there. How, how old is Pedro Pascal? Ageless. The answer is ageless. I'm about to beat this bitch up. And I saw a picture of you uh, being a good dad. You were playing with puppets or something? Hi, sisters. <laughs> you know, I tell her not to put these pictures up, you know? Oh, that's she, hot. Uh, that's yes, hot. I was a puppet show for my son, and uh, I think she got distracted. Right, yeah. <laughs> well, that's why we're showing it. Um, <laughs> Like man down to it, like bruv. Yeah. How about gassed? So I am confusion. Tired? Oh. No? No? Gassed is being really excited. Oh, really excited. Oh, I'm really, yeah, like chuffed. Yeah. Chuffed? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Oscar Isaac is literally a five course meal. My ass is sweating. So, uh, <laughs> duck butter. She's got duck butter. <laughs> <laughs> it's very sexy. Run. Can Oscar Isaac sing? Debatable. Debatable. I won't hesitate, bitch! You're an incredible singer, and he finds the opportunity to do it. I inflict it on people whenever I can. Whenever he can. We did a play together, and somehow we, there, was, there were no songs in the play, but then there were. Mm -hmm. You need to shut the f*** up. Thing last night at Carnegie Hall. Nope. Both of those things are wrong. <laughs> Night, Where did you sing night before last? Oh, okay, but it was Lincoln Carnegie Center. at Lincoln Center. <laughs> Do you, did, did it make a difference when you changed it? Well, I, since I grew up in Miami, you know, Oscar Hernandez is like John Smith. There, yeah, you know, yeah. Uh, everybody's Oscar, my dad's Oscar Hernandez, my grandpa's Oscar Hernandez, and there was other Oscar Hernandez's at the I auditions. am Oscar Hernandez. <laughs> <laughs> we are all Oscar Hernandez. <laughs> <laughs> so, so yeah, I kind of did a little shortening there, and then and I did. I got seen for more things down there, and oh, wow. you know. But uh, but it's still obviously my heritage is something I'm very proud of. So yeah. every chance I get, I do. So yes. I'm Oscar Isaac Hernandez Estrada. Oh, oh. <laughs> so my, my you killed my father. What? What did he say? Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. <laughs> Oscar Isaac is a Brooklyn hipster piece of, <laughs> and I'm gonna fight him. Sounds like a very well-adjusted human being. Yeah. Is Oscar Isaac left-handed? Nope. Only sometimes. Right. Is Oscar Isaac... When I want it to feel like someone else. Nice. He's not nice. He's not very nice. Um, he portrays himself to be very nice. But you did this for what? Why not? And he's literally the only person who has given me a wet willy since I was 14 years old. Oh, fucking do it again. That's disgusting. <laughs> and it smells like a butt. I can now officially say that I've held an Oscar on this stage. <laughs> You're so funny. Congratulations. Oscar's not so white now. <laughs> what? Language does Oscar Isaac speak? Uh, what would you call it? Uh, I would call I would it say... annoying. <laughs> the language of love. <laughs> the language of love. I would call it the language of love. I can really do Rubik's Cube, by you, the way. You're kind of like a genius. I am. Okay. My big cinematic crush was when I saw King Kong with Jessica Lange. Yeah, it got, it was bad. It was like, uh, I, my dad had just gotten a computer, and so I printed her name out in every font. Just the name and all the different types. 
uh, and yeah, and I would like dream about her. It was, it was, it was, it was heavy. <laughs> it was heavy, and I would have like, and I, it was like, it hurt. Two years ago, th yeah, two years ago, I, I, I knew I was gonna do a movie with her. So I was like, just wait to tell her. Just don't tell her right away, because it's gonna be strange. And within 30 seconds, I was like, I had the biggest crush, and I wrote your name in every font. <laughs> I'm having to play his father, um, and <laughs> clearly not old enough to play his father, hence the big beard. Oh, of course, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, <laughs> Whatever you say. So, uh, I also heard that people say, and are saying, that you are the best addition to the MCU since RDJ, Robert Downey. What do you make of that? I don't know who that is. Bitch, I hope the fuck RDJ? you do! <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, uh, no, I, I mean, th that...